So, today we get to see what it looks like when a Tesla brakes. And by brake, I don't mean stops, but I mean stops working. So, let's open the charging port. And we're going to grab the power cord here. And plug it in. Now we get the blue light. And what we want to see is a flashing green, uh, yellow light indicating that it's charging, or a green light indicating that it's full. Not surprisingly, as you might imagine, a flashing red light is not good. This is a bad sign. Now if I open up the car and I look inside at the computer, I can see the error message, power failure, service required. I have seen that message before, but it had always just actually just gone away when I would reset the charging port. But now, after trying repeatedly, I still keep getting this over and over and I can't get the car to charge further. Fortunately, it's got a fairly full battery right now, so it's not an urgent problem. But I'm not going to drive it um, until I know I can get it charged. Interestingly enough, one of the ways that you reset the charging on the Tesla is to open and close the door, this, this charging port door. So that just reset the computer. And if I were to, if I can't see it from here, if I were looking at that computer screen, it's now reset. One of the official ways to reset the electronics in the Tesla is to open and close this door 10 times fully. Uh, and that was one of the debugging techniques that Tesla recommended to me for this problem, although in this case it didn't fix it. So, it looks like someone from Tesla will be flying out to take a look at this in person.